One of the best reasons to watch The Loud House is because after watching more than a few episodes, you're left with a wholesome ending that just makes it feel good. Yes, the show does have a lot of different cliches and lessons that we've seen all the time before, but that doesn't take away from this nice feeling. Today I'll be talking about some of the most heartwarming episodes of the show that you should watch if you want to be in a good mood. With that being said, let's get on to the episodes. First up is a season 1 storyline called Making the Case, where Lincoln secretly records his sister's most embarrassing moments in order to win a video contest at school. That's a plot that would definitely hurt his sisters, so obviously we're gonna have to get some sort of good ending that'll wrap things up in a wholesome way. And in the typical Lathouse format, there's a pretty nice ending. As his own way of saying sorry to his sisters, Lincoln puts up an embarrassing video of himself, so he takes all the blame instead of his family. He's willing to put his dignity on the line just so he can take back the embarrassing moments he recorded of his sisters. But if you thought that this couldn't be more wholesome, you'd be wrong. At the very end, the sisters give Lincoln a trophy that says, Most Improved brother because he had always wanted to win one. Everyone's all happy and it's so nice and oh boy the loud house you know how to make people feel good. Another heartwarming episode is one of the boys. Now this may seem like a weird pick but there's still a nice lesson to be learned. So basically what happens here is that Lincoln gets transported into an alternate universe where all his sisters are brothers and he only does this because he's tired of living with the chaos of his sisters. Unfortunately he finds out that if everyone was a boy even more problems would rise as they act even worse than before. There are definitely bad parts about this episode, but the lesson in the end still feels good to watch. Lincoln was so disappointed in his current life that he wanted change, but he later accepts his sisters because they really aren't as bad as possible. Towards the end of the episode, he seems to love his sisters even more for who they are and doesn't want anything about them to change. One of the more memorable, wholesome Loud House episodes is Eleven Louds a Leapin'. The Louds are getting ready for Christmas when the unthinkable happens to Lincoln. His sled goes in their neighbor's yard. As Lincoln and Clyde attempt to pull off a sled rescue mission, they end up finding out secrets about Mr. Grouse. Now because this is a Christmas themed episode, you know there's gonna be feel good stuff in it. One of the most wholesome parts about this whole special was how the entire Loud family worked together so they could actually make Mr. Grouse's Christmas his first happy one in a long time. Mr. Grouse was also sad because he rarely gets a chance to see his family anymore, so we got a nice moment when the Louds let him have a bus ticket to make that happen. The entire plot of making someone's Christmas feel nice because they've been sad for a long time is a cliche, of course, but the way the Loud House handled it still made me feel good. On the second day of Christmas, the Loud House gave to me two turtlenecks, ew, ew, and a phone plan for me and Bobby. On the third day of Christmas, the Loud House gave to me three French horns. It was a wholesome episode developing this character that we haven't seen too much of, and it shows that you probably shouldn't judge people just by looking at them. Mr. Grouse seemed to be a terrible person based on how he acted, but Lincoln and the rest of the gang realized that he actually wasn't a bad guy, he just missed his family. That's why they all wanted to team up to help him out. The final heartwarming Loud House episode I'll be talking about is the whole picture. Lincoln accidentally erases all of his old childhood photos, so he and Clyde try to recreate them before the former loses his memories. Throughout the episode, Episode, Lincoln is in a panic since he's losing his past and he has no way of remembering it. But over the course of the storyline, we see a really nice lesson and everything feels so wholesome. Even though Lincoln can't get the pictures back, all the sisters begin reminiscing about the past and they talk about all the amazing things they've done. They say that pictures aren't necessary when they have their memory intact and they can all work together to remember what happened to them the past few years. Eventually, everyone hugs and a new picture is taken, which Lincoln puts on the computer to start a brand new photo library for the future. Future. The lesson here is that memories are the most important things, and it's about the experience itself, not too much about the recording of it. The whole picture felt very wholesome to watch. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos, give a thumbs up and comment below let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.